All right, let's keep going. Now we're on exercise five, but as you can see, it says to use exercise four, and so I've included that one up here just for reference. Um, wow, you sh that is a fire or emergency ambulance, I don't know, whatever it is. If you can hear stuff, just ignore it. This one's going to be quick. So we're looking at problem five here, and so basically the first thing that we're going to do is... Um, we want to be able to write new one plus new two and work with this sign measure. But we don't know, um, like per se, that we can actually write this thing because what if we like take new one of our SpaceX and we take new two of our SpaceX and this is infinity and this is minus infinity and now we've just written down something that's not defined. Um, so what we have to do is we have to explicitly state that we're using this fact. So since um, new one and new two both omit either infinity or minus infinity. So like maybe one one can be finite and one could be plus or minus infinity or they could both take the value infinity or they could both take minus infinity but they can't have one is infinity and the other is minus infinity. Um, so now we can write new one plus new two, which is a new me with new N E W measure. And if we write this out, this is just new one plus minus new one minus if we like decompose it into positive and negative parts. And we also get this. So this decom is a decom uh, decomposition of this and similarly for similarly for new two. So now that we have this, uh, we rearrange the stuff and so we get new one plus plus new two plus and we subtract new one minus plus new two minus. Now we're going to make this, we're going to define this to be lambda minus mu. So lambda is a positive measure that's just this and mu is a positive measure that's just this. All right, now by exercise four, we have um, lambda is greater than or equal to new one plus new two plus. So this thing is a separate um, measure. Uh, when you when you add the two sign measures, you get a new sign measure, an E W sign measure, and this is just the positive part of this. Okay, and Likewise, mu is greater than or equal to new one plus new two minus. So then we have um, variation of new one plus variation new two. Well, what is this? This is just new one plus plus new one minus plus new two plus plus new two minus. And what is this? This is just lambda plus mu because we see we get the new one plus and the new two plus and that's that and then we get new one minus new two minus and that's just this and because we have the minus here we gotta account for that and stuff and anyways this is what we get do 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 i there okay um and so now what is this this is greater than or equal to by what we just proved new one two plus new new one plus new two plus plus new one plus new two minus and that's just equal to new one plus new two, and we're done.